request you to hold on to that thought. And in fact, Ashmita has further queries for you as well. But for the time being, let's hop across to Mr. Sanjay, that Director of Quantum Securities, who joins us. Uh, uh, hi, Mr. Dutt. Good morning. Uh, you know, could you tell us your first reaction to this particular uh, verdict that's just come out? And how do you approach the stocks in the interim? Uh, Nigel, thank you for having me on the show. I think uh, the outcome is very positive with the deliberation that the Supreme Court uh, did, the arguments that have happened and what they finally pronounced. And I don't have much to add that as compared to what uh, Mr. What, what senior advocate Renan has already said. But I just had one small bit to add here is that I'm glad something like this has come and we've got some decisive course of action because we need to not take this off the public discourse the political mudslinging, what debates we've had in the parliament, what we're having in social media. There's a lot of mind space and a lot of energies being wasted and misinformation that's being spread around. So this probably should now lessen that or put an end to it. I don't know. But right. I think a good part is that uh, government can now, you know, make it very clear to people that there is a Supreme Court appointed committee is looking into all these things. And of course, we've right. got eminent members like... Uh, so, uh, Mr. K. V. Kamar, and you know, I don't think you could have a better committee as what is uh, Supreme Court said. And third, point. most important is SEBI. Any is doing everything. Right. So, I think SEBI is taking care of everything. So, I've, I've netted. I think that everything is positive from whatever has happened today. Right. You know, uh, uh, it's a fair point uh, that you've made out there, uh, Sanjay. Uh, we also have with uh, us Mr. Abhishek Rastogi. He is, of course, uh, a founder, the founder of uh, Rastogi Chambers. 